This reading is for Pisces for the month of March, year 2024. Please check your moon, your rising, and your Venus. Please take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Hit the like button, share, and subscribe. This is a general reading. Allah, please send... Ooh, already. Allah, please... Ooh, dang. Allah, please send... Pisces, 200 angels to stand, guard, guide, and protect. Allah, please send me 200 angels to stand, guard, guide, and protect me as I open this portal. I do not partner you with my divination, but I ask of you to guide me through so that this reading is truthful, accurate, and honest. The first cards out is the Queen of Cups and the Knight of Wands. Okay, so this is a Pisces reading. It could be another water sign involved, a cancer, um, a Scorpio, or this is your energy, fast energy, in and out energy, okay? Starting something and never finish it type of energy. Fast movement. Why is this here? Allah confirm the Queen of Cups and this Knight of Wands. Four of Cups. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, so you are dissatisfied in player energy. Something didn't work in your favor, okay? You, you could possibly be rejecting someone or someone could be rejecting you. Somebody wished they never turned down an offer, okay? You possibly feel like you, you wish you never turned down an offer. Allah, what is this? Somebody is completely dissatisfied. Somebody rejected the hand of God. Somebody rejected, ooh, the devil, okay? So somebody is sitting and soaking in devil energy a Capricorn could be involved but when you have this devil energy this is somebody that's compulsive somebody that's obsessive somebody that's materialistic have deep dark secrets perversities uh substance abuse judging people okay Ooh, uh, Allah Ramadan is in two days please reveal the knight of wands queen of cups the four of cups and the devil. Somebody possibly feels as though they gave a, a devil, gave the offer to a devil. Okay, yeah, somebody's in a relationship. We got Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, two of cups. Somebody feels like they're in a relationship with the damn devil. Why does someone feel as though that they're in a relationship with the devil? Somebody was also possessive over a relationship, a two of cups uh, relationship at that. Somebody could have a child or this is a sibling, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay, like I said, siblings could be involved. Um, children could be involved. This could be somebody that took this upon themselves to um, look at it as a, an opportunity here. Show me this page of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Oh, Yeah. Somebody's in denial. Somebody's not telling the truth. Somebody's lying. Somebody's trying to protect themselves, protect their feelings. Uh, but this is the denial here. So somebody's sister or brother denied the Ten of Swords. Okay? Somebody's sister or brother was involved. Okay? And the Two of Swords and the Ten of Swords, somebody thought that they was very powerful. Trouble's on the way, though. Trouble has been on the way. Somebody's trying to block out what they have done. Somebody's trying to block out trouble. Somebody's trying to act like a victim. Ooh. Show me this brother or sister that could be involved with the two of swords and the ten of swords. For Pisces. Yeah. Calls the tower. Calls the tower. Seven of swords is, is lying, stealing, cheating. Somebody knew that they broke up a, a union. Yep, this is witchcraft. You got the moon here. Uh, cancer, Pisces, energy. Okay, this is the moon. That's witchcraft. Somebody knew what they did to break this down, to tear it up. Okay, so this is jealousy. Seven of swords is lying, cheating, stealing. Somebody is trying to deny what caused the ending. And this person could be a brother or a sister. If not a brother or a sister, it could just be someone that's an adult that has a childlike mind.
We have the Queen of Wands here, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, and the Page of Wands. Okay, so there's a message. Show me this message. Queen of Wands and the Page of Wands. This person could be a trendsetter. You can have fire in your chart. Okay, show me this Page of Wands and this Queen of Wands. Somebody's spying. Somebody is spying on this... Uh, Queen of Wands. This Queen of Wands could have had spoke the truth and it was ignored. Okay? But somebody is spying. Somebody's obsessed. Show me this Page of Wands and Queen of Wands and the Page of Swords here. For Pisces. Searching. This Queen of Wands, Leo Aries Sagittarius, did some soul searching, went within and found answers within within themselves, okay, um, on why certain things um, was happening. This Queen of Wands is not the one that is in the Five of Cups, okay? It's This is what they wanted for a Queen of Wands. Could be an air sign, okay, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, or a Leo Aries Sagittarius. Somebody thought that this was going to happen to the person that uh, was broken up from their partner. Um, the Ten of Swords is here. Okay, so the Ten of Swords uh, is that betrayal that was placed on this either Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, or a fire sign. It didn't happen that way because this Queen of Wands got the message, okay, did the soul searching and knew that this was a repeated pattern and let it go. So, who's in this Five of Cups energy and the Eight of Cups for walking away? King of Swords. Okay? King of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Somebody knew. Somebody knew that, that this was over, that they couldn't come back. Who got strength here? Somebody knows that someone is hella strong. Okay? Then And the fire sign turned their back. Like, it's, I'm done with it. Okay, you can have that person from your past. This is what's going on. Or this is what has already happened. So a fire sign said, I don't want nothing to do with it. You made your choice. You made your bed. Go line it. Now you're stuck with someone, Pisces. Who is Pisces stuck with? Who is Pisces stuck with? Oh, you're stuck in judgment, though. You're being judged. Who, oops, hold on, who is Pisces stuck with, under judgment, who is Pisces stuck with Allah? They went to a somebody went to a whole hard like this was this was uh, strategized planned out. Five of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You could be stuck in a situation with the Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Someone's feeling left out in the cold. Someone's not going to be able to pay their bills. You got the Three of Cups here, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. There's a lot of slander and gossip that circulates. Okay, that's that, that's circling. Friends is betraying each other. You have the Seven of Swords here. Uh, that's lying, stealing, and cheating. You have the Eight of Swords. Somebody is restricted from communicating. So you could be dealing with these signs, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, okay? So somebody was restricted from talking to someone. Somebody is feeling trapped. They're feeling like they are forced into living into someone's rules. Mm-hmm. They're stuck. They, they, this empress here. Who's the empress? Somebody that was married. Somebody was married to this empress. Empress could be Aries. And now somebody is stressed the hell out. They're, they're stressed. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Somebody is so attractive, they're beautiful. Okay? And, and someone else is finding out that whoever they chose over the emperor or the empress is trash. Yep, they feel wounded. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Ten of Pentacles. People can be involved. Investments could be um, wounded. Okay? People are falling out because there's people on a card. So, 
These people on this card is talking about each other. They're slandering each other. And yes, there is wounded uh, energy in the finances. Okay? So, yeah. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. What I tell you? King of Pentacles. Okay? Seven of Pentacles. All what they invested in, they didn't get anything back but broken promises. High Priestess. Yeah, there's a Virgo, Pisces, or Gemini that's happy. This was their wish fulfillment. This is going to keep coming out until this King of Pentacles or you make it right. Yeah, because there's no happiness there. There's no happiness. Everything went right back with that devil energy, that moon energy. So, Pisces, you could be a witch. There could be witches involved. It could be a coven. Okay, and you guys are burdened due by the witchcraft. Yes, yeah, so stop playing with it. Nobody, this, this came out, it always comes out. Stop playing with this. Stop playing with this. This is nothing to play with. You don't know what you're doing. And this is why there's so much burdens. Trying to attack someone else. Mm -mm. Yep, that was your decision. And I'm speaking the truth. That was your decision. That was your choice. This is what happens. Okay? So you're in the three of swords energy. And possibly somebody's getting tossed around like a rag doll. Everybody is fighting each other. Okay? <laughs> now somebody is realizing when they was with the empress. When they was with the empress or the emperor over here. They were actually peaceful. They're finding out that, they're stab that they were more stable. That they had more. Okay? And this person, whoever this person is. They have professionalism. They have faith. They have God. They have higher learning. And the only thing what these people have is jealousy and conflict. Okay, these past people who contradict themselves, trying to control, being selfish, being ignorant, being basically um, the devil. So what's the outcome with the five of swords and the five of wands? This is domestic violence. There's going to be a lot of fighting, a lot of arguing. Yeah, because the illusion is coming back. The illusion is facing everybody that's that's involved. They're in this dark energy now. Okay? They're not going to get away with it. Why is the seven of cups, this illusion going back? Oh, the queen of pentacles also calls imbalances. Trying to be greedy, keep all the money for themselves. Here, here this queen of pentacles is possibly talking to you. Because remember that page of pentacles that I had showed you? That's a sibling. It could be a child or a sibling. It could be a, a, an adult that has a childlike mind. Okay? A low IQ. This is who you were talking to. This is what you was discussing to hold back. Hold back and cause imbalances. Well, what are you going to do now that this illusion is back on you and everybody is in the five of swords and the five of wands? Cruelty, abuse. It was done in the past. So if you are that Pisces that has to put witchcraft on a man or a woman to get them, you suck. Truly, you suck. This is the truth, what I'm saying. And other people are seeing the truth. If this happened to you, then stay prayed up, Pisces. But if you cause this, it's going to be nothing but poverty, embezzlement of funds, mismanagement, because somebody was blocking someone else's finances, somebody destroyed someone else's marriage, somebody blocked out a, a true chosen one that somebody was married to or in a relationship with. Justice is in reverse, so you're not going to be for three people, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, that work together as a team. You're not going to be able to pay your bills properly. Um, there's going to be violence. There's going to be injustice. Um, girl agencies, somebody didn't follow the laws. Why is the three of pentacles here with justice in reverse? Okay, the, the reckless behavior. Reckless behavior, chaotic, just chaos. You didn't, nobody cared. They didn't care about the outcome. So don't boo-hoo, woo-hoo now. God is on your head. You're not protected. Somebody might pass away. Somebody has to update their will. Somebody is not protected. Somebody can't sleep. Ace of Pentacles, there's no blessings. Four of Wands in reverse, there's no stability. King of Wands, somebody's not feeling sexy or attractive anymore. Somebody wants to slow down. King of Wands is in reverse. That's Sagittarius. Aries or Sagittarius or, or Leo. But somebody here, this King of Wands is losing a home, lost their blessings here. 
Show me the king of wands with the four of wands in reverse and the ace of pentacles in reverse because they got exposed. The sun is here, the sun, the truth, and the moon. Yeah, that's reflection. Everything is being reflected back upon you or whoever else is involved that did this. So, Allah, confirm the sun, the moon, and the ace of swords. Yeah, that cycle period is closed out. No money for you or whoever did this. Six of pentacles is in reverse, so it's going to be hard to mismanage to manage funds. It's got, Nobody's going to give. That's why the five of pentacles is there, because people are losing support. So mismanagement of funds, not being able to pay your bills, not being able to pay your rent. People are going to stop giving, okay? And you have the star card, which is healing, hopes, inspirations, and dreams in reverse. Somebody's not going to be able to heal from this. Somebody's not going to be able to heal from this. And this was the choice made, playing with this witchcraft. Nobody cares. All these people involved doesn't care. They're not truthful. They're not faithful. They're bad with money. And I'm going to say this because I see that money is highlighted here. Somebody is not trustworthy. They bring insecurities in a relationship. Show me the king of cups in reverse. Yeah, you can't move on to common waters. The relationships is falling apart. Six of cups is in reverse and six of swords is in reverse. No moving to common waters. If there was a lawsuit involved, the lawsuit was not in your favor. It wasn't in someone's favor here. Um, relationships is, is falling apart. Relentless pursuits of money. Interference. All for what? For jealousy and envy? Queen of Swords, death. You know it's over. You know it's over. You know. You got Scorpio here. And you got Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Somebody knows it's over. Somebody didn't want to go through a rebirth. They didn't want to go through an ascension. They didn't want to, they didn't want to change. Show me death in Scorpio. The death in Scorpio. The death in Scorpio. Queen of Swords. Somebody knows. Oh, that it's karma. It's karma because an offer of reconciliation stopped. If that offer of reconciliation that was supposed to be given to the rightful person was given, there wouldn't have been no karma. There wouldn't be no poverty. Okay, so I hope that helped you.